That is just horrific. They didn't ask for this treatment. They're just forced to stay in this environment and suffer and die. The sides of this kennel are 100% plywood, as long as the top as well. So if you look inside here, I mean, that's complete and total darkness in there. Hi, baby. Yes, we're gonna get you out. And this is where we have animals living, okay? You see the cobwebs, the spiderwebs across the door? And there's a skull. Oh my God. Oh God, poor thing. Baby. There is a deceased Yorkie inside of there. That poor terrier died in this confinement. You come to a scene like this expecting things to be bad. Um, I don't know, as long as you're in animal welfare, I don't know if you're ever really ready or equipped to, to really be prepared for that. It's just not right to keep animals living like this. I mean, it's a living, breathing creature. And you don't have to love them to see that this is wrong. We can only speculate that um, one of her legs probably fell through that wire flooring in the kennels that they're kept in. And without anyone checking on her on a regular basis, didn't know that she was caught until she lost part of her limb. This is a really sad, filthy situation that you have here a mama chihuahua with her two deceased necrotic puppies inside of there from her previous litter that she is actually eating off of their bodies for survival here. This little face just wants to be loved. This is the entire carcass of what would probably have been a standard poodle. The entire animal either was laid here when it died or even after it was dead, it was just placed right on, above ground. I mean, no dignity or whatever to at least bury the body. Complete disregard for life. We definitely need to change the laws in Mississippi that reflect um, some degree of accountability for people who want to breed animals as a source of income. Don't buy your pets online. Don't buy them at a flea market. Um, don't buy them at a, a pet store. This is the kind of scenes that you're supporting. This is just something that no, no animal should experience. And so these guys, what we're all doing here is, is, is hoping that they have a second chance to have a life that they were meant to have.